Baby. Hey, baby. I miss you so much. Babe, we're going to talk every day. And you're gone for what? Like four days? I feel so bad missing your birthday. It's not a big deal. All right? <laughs> Besides, I don't have anything special planned. Your birthday means a lot to me. Okay. We'll do whatever you want us to do when you get back from that trip. How about that? Okay. Yeah. I like that very much. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right. Come on, let's go so you don't miss your flight. Mm -hmm. huh? I miss you so much, baby. I miss you too. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'll give you this. Ah, I can't believe you changed your mind about your trip to Calabar. I know. So I was at the airport and then I realized that Frank has never done a party for his birthday before. And then I thought to myself, why don't I organize something for him? Wait, is it what I'm thinking? Yes! <laughs> we have a party to play! <laughs> Uh, wait, and that's not the most interesting part. The most interesting part is that he doesn't know that I'm in town. He thinks I'm still on my Calabar trip. Okay, so he's going to think you're far away in Calabar and then boom, surprise party. Right. I love it. <laughs> right. But uh, what did you tell the organizers of the photo summit? Oh, I told them that my grandmother died. Uh, I know. Ah. I bet your grandmother has died like 20 <laughs> times. Bruh, she's tired of dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, baby. I just settled in. That's good. How was your flight? The flight was beautiful. I actually just settled in the hotel and I'm just chilling. <laughs> I hope it's comfortable. It is, actually. I miss you so much, baby. I don't know how I'm going to go these three days without you. It's going to feel like hell. I miss you so much. I miss you too, baby. Um, babe, I have a lot to wrap up, so I have to go freshen up now, and then we'll talk tomorrow. All right. No problem. I love you. I love you too, baby. Mwah, 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 mwah. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I told you he wouldn't notice. Oh my goodness, oh. I can't wait to see his face on Sunday. Mm. You know, your baby might just break down in tears. <laughs> no, and Frank is a very, very emotional person, really. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything that oh. you do for me. Please don't mention. I am glad to be a part of this romantic prank. <laughs> Look, I just might even add it to part of the speech I want to give on your wedding reception. All right. <laughs> you know, he bought it like completely. Totally, he did. <laughs> oh yeah, stretch my hands. My hands have been moving. They're so dramatic. <laughs> <laughs> mm. So, should I call him now? Of course not. Look, he needs to believe you're in the photo summit in Calabar and that you're very busy, okay? But I miss him. This babe. I share with your eyes, though. You know what? Let me have it. Your phone. Do not think about touching this phone until I say so. So today, we are going to make a list of all the things we need to pull off a surprise party. And top of the list will definitely be booking a good saxophonist. I mean, <laughs> what is a surprise party without some of that? <laughs> and then we can have the cake and drinks, small chops. Whatever you want. Um, I'm thinking of maybe inviting some of his colleagues. I like it. Good idea. But we do. What if they snitch on us and tell him our plan? Uh, I don't think they will. I will invite just a few of them. Maybe about three people. And I will tell them not to let the cat out of the bag. Okay. It's not like I will invite the whole office. <laughs> okay. What? Babe. The 
listen. We need to handpick for you one of those Asheru gowns. Something that when you wear and enter, everyone will scatter. See what I did there? Enter, scatter. <laughs> Something that would show all your curves and edges, your sexiness and style. Hi, Rebigiri Sitiri Bosuto. What is wrong with my style? Oh, please. You dress like a drunk tomboy with all your baggy shirts and trousers. Come on. Girl, you need to pop some ass tomorrow. I mean, who knows? Something might lead to something. You know what I mean? Hmm? There's nothing wrong with my style. I'm not wearing any stupid dress. By the time I'm done with you, you said you will not recognize yourself. Baby girl, pop some ass tomorrow. Popping some ass tomorrow. <laughs> not giving what I wanted to give. You know what? Let's go shopping. Please, let's do it tomorrow. Babe, tomorrow is for all other movements. Let's go, let's go. I hope we will not stay out late. We're not going to stay out late too. Stop complaining. Let's just Look, you're go. even stressing me because I mean, what's wrong with my style? I can just wear one, one of my big trousers and, and my t-shirt and, and my sneakers and then just go for this party. What's the problem? You're stressing me. When you're done, we'll go for shopping and you'll wear what I want you to wear. Please. Mm -hmm. It's your baby's birthday. You need to look good, baby. Let's go. I'm so tired. You told me it wasn't going to take long. Uh, babe, I'm sorry. Do you know it was going to take that long? I'm so exhausted trying out girls' clothes. Ugh. Babe, I still can't get over how you looked when you wore that dress. Ugh. You looked so beautiful, so breathtaking. Mm. I'm sure that after God created you, he turned to Angel Michael and said, Damn, I am good with this creation. You're such a weirdo. Please <laughs> stop. I'm serious. Anyway, thank you so much. I don't know what I would have done without you. Absolutely nothing. You know what? <clears throat> Take. Oh. Okay. <laughs> hey, baby. Hey, love. You sound very tired. I am tired. I'm exhausted from a whole day of taking photographs. How are you? I've missed you so much. Mm -hmm. You miss me too? Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be back soon. Yes, please, just try and come in early. Um, say by 5 p.m. And please, one more thing, do not let Frank know. You give me your word. Okay, thank you so much. Okay then, I'll see you at the party. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> ah, babes. I just texted the saxophonist and the cake lady. Unfortunately, both of them won't be able to make it. So what do we do? Yeah, don't worry. Hmm? I mean, the small chops lady is still coming. That's not enough to spoil a surprise party. Okay. Anyway, I just finished calling the last person. I invited three of his colleagues, though one of them said she might not be able to make it. <sighs> Mommy, I'm scared though. What if they snitch on us? No, 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 no. They wouldn't. They gave me their word. Besides, it's not a working day, so where would they even see Frank? Hmm, that's true, Sha. So tell me, how do you feel? Pretty anxious, actually. <laughs> My dear friend, you know what is doing you? What? Love. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, baby. <laughs> oh, thanks, baby. So what are you doing today? Uh, nothing much. I'm going to see a movie and then I'll be back home. 
and I'll sleep. So you want to go and see a movie without me? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm just trying to get myself distracted before you come back. <laughs> okay, um, so let me know what time you'll be back so I can call you later. Movie ends at 7, so I should be back home at 8. Okay, I'll call you then. Take care of yourself. Have a nice day. Bye. And mm -hmm. you too, baby. Bye. So guys, here's the plan. As soon as we get a text that he's in the estate, I'll turn off the lights, right? Mm -hmm. And then everyone will wait for him to come in. Once he settles on the sofa, I'll turn the lights back on and we begin to sing immediately, right? And then <laughs> his beautiful and ever gorgeous bride, girlfriend, <laughs> We we'll take center stage and see what she has planned for her man. <laughs> right? All right, guys, let's have fun. Wait, wait, wait. I think I have a message. Guys, it's the one. Let's. Wait, guys. Hi, guys. The way you they shine. Ah, Lucy, so you are here since all this while. Eh? I don't even see you. Eh? That's that that's that time we, we talk last time. When I tell you, make you come see me for my house. 
Lucy, you did not come. And it's not good. My Lord, uh, I've yeah. just been very busy. Besides, you have a wife. So what am I going to do in your house? Lucy, I have a wife? Lucy, Lucy, you know, say I'll be man. I fit to marry one, I fit to marry two, I fit to marry three. Yeah, I can marry as much as I like. Son, Lord, you cannot marry me. Why are you saying that? Lucy, anyway, not be waiting to bring me come here. What of this your friend, uh, Benita? She's not around. Do you know that yesterday, I called Benita more than 100 times. Benita did not pick my call. And her number was switched off. Landlord, it's not intentional. She currently doesn't have access to her phone. She better do and her phone, no. Because, you see, this one I'm talking like this is because I'm in a good mood today. Because I have families that I'm feeding and my children's school fees. She, her rent is due and she refused to pay rent. If I come here next time and she has not paid her rent, see, Lucy, you will not like what I will do to that girl. I am going to chase her out of my house. I thought you said you like me. So, Lucy, I like you and I love you. It's not something that I will be hiding. You understand? But as a man, I have to take my, my, my focus and I have to be serious. Do you understand? I have to take care of my children and my wife so that I can feed them and pay school fees. Do you understand me? Now, Lord, if you like me, you'll give my friend time to pay up the rent. Sometime? Lucy, stop saying all this and so because I cannot, I cannot be, 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 be starving myself here. Okay. I'll tell her what you said. Okay. Thank you. You better talk to her. Hello. Hello. Chai. Oh. This is good. This is good. Hello. Was it the landlord? But babe, I thought you had your rent covered. <coughs> I did <coughs> until until what? Um, he asked me to borrow him some money. Wait, what? You mean you gave Frank money? How come I'm just hearing about this for the first time? How much did you give him? Two million. Two what? Two million there. Get up. Get up. Let's go get your money. What are we going Leave it to me. Just follow me. Let's go.
Wait, have some water. Thank you. Is that fine? Yeah, thank you. Has it called yet? Don't worry, babe. He'll call. And if he doesn't, you and I will march straight to his house. And this time around, <laughs> Frank will see the stuff I'm made of. Okay? <sighs> Babe, just relax. I promise we'll get your money back, okay? And I thought this was the perfect picture. <sighs> Frank? Yes, not be, not be Frank. Adonatus, Oka landlord. Hello? 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 Hello, Oka landlord. Lucy, give Benita the phone. Landlord, she cannot talk now. Who don't know who is fire? Landlord, calm down. Eh? She will pay you your money. Just have some patience. She has three days to pay me my money, or she should go and find a place under the bridge. Haba now, landlord. It has not gotten to that point now. Uh -uh. It has gotten, no. It has gotten. Okay, I hear you. Stand up, let's go to the house. Are you sure that is a good idea? Are you serious? We need to get your money back from that cheat. Come on, let's go, let's go. He will regret the day he crossed you. Stand up. Babe, stand up, let's go. Traitor! Cheat! Liar! Come out! Frank, come outside! Come outside! Relax. Come outside, Frank! I can see your car. Come outside! Frank, if you know that you are born of a woman, come outside! Hey, these guys play with me. You want to see crazy, Abby? Frank! Frank! You want to see crazy? Frank, if I count 10 and you don't come outside, I swear to God, I'll, I'll, I'll tell this face. You don't know me. Frank, one. Frank, two. Hey, this, this boy thinks I'm joking. Three. Frank! Four. Five. Six. Babe, go to sleep with me. Frank, I'm coming in, you oh. I'm coming in. Come and put my nyash, I beg. Push my ass on me. Lucy, calm down. Push me, I beg. Lucy, Lucy, it's too dangerous. Just calm down. Lucy, please. Push me. Please, please. Frank, come out, oh. Lucy, come please. out. Calm down. Why are you that dangerous? Please. I go beat. What's going on? Why claim me the first now? Oh, guys, it's your business. Excuse me. I'm in charge of this house. And if you don't leave here now, I'm going to call the police. Wait. <laughs> You're threatening me. Eh? Listen. I know Frank is inside, and if you like, go and call, 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 call the police. He will, they will end up arresting you and your stupid boss, Frank. Frank? Yes, he's not the owner of this car. He's the one that owns this car. What do you mean, Frank? Easy. First of all, I see you have a bone to pick with Frank. But Frank is not my boss. I'm the house agent. So? Frank has relocated abroad. I've sold the house and the car. The new occupant are moving in soon. Okay, what nonsense are you saying? Frank that we saw last week. Which useless relocation? Babe, relax. Don't listen to him. Frank, come outside. Come and help me, please. Okay, now come and help me now. You're dead. Look at Come and help me. What happened? 
you passed out. This is true, right? Look, I'm sorry about what happened between you and uh, Frank. Truth is, I barely know the guy. Thank you so much for your kindness. But we have to be on our way now. Anita, please, please. Don't go. Please, promise, please go. Let's leave this place. Take this. My love, let's go. He's not worth it. He's not. I know, I know, babe, I know. So sorry. At once. <clears throat> Let's go. you feel even better? Let's hit the club. Oh. No, let's go. Let's, let's get dressed. Come, come. You can't say no to me. Let's go. Come, come, come. We're going. We have to the club, so don't wait up. You only got back from London just last week. Don't you even rest? But I've rested enough. Perhaps, which has been telling me about clubs in Nigeria, so we decided to give it a shot tonight. 
<laughs> You're no longer a London boy. You can't keep wearing hoodies and sneakers and expecting to catch a serious girlfriend. No one will take you seriously. <laughs> <laughs> Not when you're looking like a boarding student who skips class to club. <laughs> <laughs> but you know how much I love to wear hoodies, huh? <laughs> well, we have to go, okay? Be good, okay? Mm, good night. Safe. All right, thank you. All right, good night, So much fun, man. <laughs> I told you you would. I'm really getting used to this left hand drive. <laughs> Welcome to Nigeria. Oh. My goodness. Are you drunk or blind? Mr. Man, if you don't know how to drive a car, you better pack it somewhere. Um, please. We are very, very sorry. I'm so sorry, okay? You're sorry? Oh, you think you hit us and sorry would fix it? Eh? I mean, we're thankful that we, we didn't get to hit you guys. Better thank your stars you didn't hit any of us. Nonsense. Um, I think we'll have to get you a driver. We can't keep running into people like that. Oh, come on, Bucci, come on. I was just distracted for a second. Did you see those girls? Girls? I was talking about the other one, the quiet one who didn't see anything. Oh, you mean those girls? Those, yeah. were, those were just prostitutes who just came back from their hustle. Uh, wait, don't tell me out of all the girls in the club, it's just prostitutes on the road that are entering your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't die. <laughs> Voila. Of all the girls. Um, that reminds me. How about Frank? Frank. He stopped talking to me after he asked me for money and I refused to lend him some money. But you know, I don't know how he did it, but he's in London at the moment. I'm just very grateful that I did not trust my business with him, but you. Um, about our product launch on Monday, I have made every necessary plan for it. I just need a, a professional photographer who will be there to take professional photos of us. Um, also, I have informed the investors and the board of directors that you're going to be personally present. Mochi, you just like to ruin our conversations when we're having fun moments with business talks. And... See, I, I trust you enough, all right? And that's why I let you lead. Don't worry. Just go ahead, uh, okay? David, you are the CEO and not me. I am just a manager. I know, but a good manager is equally as important as the CEO. Huh? <laughs> you win. <laughs> Bad guy. <laughs> The photographer. Yes, yes. <coughs> oh, this is of Benny's photos. <coughs> this is Benita of of of, of Benny photos, right? <coughs> are, you, are you okay? <coughs> <coughs> Hello. This is Benita's PA, sir. We need you to help us be the official photographer for our event. Terry and your Instagram page, and I must confess, you. Nice. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Um, can I get back to you shortly? We need to check our schedule to be sure we're free. Please do. Okay, well. You can't do the job. Why? Babe, take a look at yourself. You're an emotional mess right now. I'll I, call to cancel. I need the money, Lucy. I need the money. That's true, Sha. But do you think they will agree to pay full payment so that we can at least pay Baba Landlord your rent? No, I usually take half. Nobody yeah. agrees to pay full payment. Let's try full and see. Give me. Let's try. This is the last number that called you, Abby. Yeah. 
Hello, sir. Um, yes, this is Benita's PA. We will take the job, sir. Mm. Uh, how much do you charge? Um, just 400k, sir. We will pay 200k. We will cover for just two days. It's a new product launch. Oh, okay, sir. That's fine. Where is the location? All right. Address and date will be texted to you now by my secretary. Meanwhile, send in your account number for some advance. Uh, about that, sir. Is it possible for you to pay in full so that we can... Are you seriously joking? Uh, sorry, sir. I, I like to crack jokes. Um, it's fine. We'll take the job. We'll take the job. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, I told you. Nobody agrees to pay full payment. Wow. Do you think we should send the account number again? No, now. We want them to think we're desperate. But we are desperate. <laughs> we are. Calm down. The event is in two days at a bottling company in phase one. Okay. They sent an advance of 100k. Hmm. So I think we should add it to the money you want to give the landlord and promise to pay him the remaining next week. Landlord is never going to agree to take half payment. Don't worry. I'll give it to him myself. Okay, if you say so. Lucy, 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 you again. Oh, God, come in, come in. <laughs> This is just common cutsy. Uh -uh. Oh, you think I'll poison your drink? Happen. Thank you. Mm. Oh, God, don't. Oh, God, don't. See, as my name, just this sweet for your mouth. Pere, 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 pere. I hope you are not up to something. Uh -uh. Your name is sweet normally now. Mm. Oh, God, don't. The one and only landlord with swag in this wide estate. Hmm. Hey, mm -hmm. take them easy now. I'm good now. I need you to do me a tiny favor. Favor? Hm. I know where you are going. Mm -hmm. I know exactly where you are going, Lucy. I know you want me to add more time to this your friend, Benita. That is where you are going. And you want me and my family to go hungry mm -hmm. because of uh, I want to help somebody. Eh? Don't you know that I have responsibility? When I calm down now, at least allow me land first. I know where you are going. The answer is no. That is it. Oh, God, don't I will not. Oh, God, don't See, if you do me this favor, mm -hmm. I promise to come to your house. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> See, all I want you to do for me is just allow us pay 500k now, and then we we'll balance the rest next week. 500? No, 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 no. Lucy, I know where you are going and I know where you are coming from. Lucy, it cannot work. The answer is pure no. I cannot accept 500,000. I cannot. Because the only thing I can do for you people is if you people can give me 700,000 naira. That is the only money I will collect and then everything will be fine. Because of you. And, they, and they, if you do not pay, if you it's, people do not pay okay. that. It's okay, Ogaduna, it's okay. 700k, Abi? Yes. 
700k. That is what I'm going to collect. And if you people do not pay that 700k by this time next week, I will come here and chase you people. No, Wahala, 700k it is. Yes, that is it. Check in that. No problem. Lucy, so how far about our discussion? You say you are going to come. You are going to come. I never see you. Your blood is too hot. Calm down now. Don't worry, I'll tell you when I'll come. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. If you come, hmm, I am going to do something that you will like. As you are begging me, I will do something for you. I'm serious. Are you serious? Yes, Lucy. Lucy, you know, you know, you know, sir, I know they use you play. Okay, play a drink. <laughs> Lucy, Lucy. Don't be too <laughs> stiff, drink. Oh, God, Oh, God, what did Ooh. he say? Mama, he refused the 500k. Oh. But I told you he will. The clown said he will only collect 700k because of me. Ha. <sighs> Babe, I, I know you're low on cash, so I'll send you some money by next week when I get paid. Don't worry, you don't have to worry. I, I will figure it out. I, I'll find a way around it. <laughs> By the time you sleep under the bridge for two days, nobody will tell you. You know you're crazy, right? And if I have to sleep under the bridge, you're coming with me. Because you're my best friend and we'll do everything together. <laughs> no, but seriously, what do I do? <sighs> Why, how did I let Frank do this to me? Relax. I said I'll give you money now. Is it no money? How you're much is more money? money. What would you do for me? <laughs> Yeah. We have to do lunch. So I'll yeah. see you later, okay? Jake. Ma. You can't dress like this going to a lunch. We're not doing this again, are we? Do what exactly? Boy, you're the CEO of a company. You wear a suit. You can't dress like this going for a company for that lunch. Mom, you know how much I don't like to wear suits. Huh? It doesn't make me feel comfortable. It's not my style. I don't even know where you get all this wearing of hoodies from. Makes you look like a young jambite. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, just stop. Stop. We don't write the stuff. Stop, stop, stop. But I think it's high time we start to address people with respect and not by how they look or what they wear. No, really? Yes. Ever heard of the phrase, dress the way you be addressed? My point exactly. You're thinking like them. But you know what? I, I promise. I'll wear a suit next time. But let this pass. You know, I love you, Mom. Oh, all right. <laughs> Have a good day. Thank you, Mom. So, David? Oh. <clears throat> Are we set for today? Oh, yes, we are. We're set for the launch. Great. But then um, you need to sign the contract for the delivery of the final project. And after that, do you have any other meetings to attend to? Of course. You still have to meet with the investors. Mm. Cool. All right, let's go. Um, David, don't you think what your mom said about your dress and is right? You cannot be thinking like an old man, would you? <sighs> let's go, or you have to explain to your investors why I'm not in the meeting. I would leave you here. Um, the key. I want to drive, I feel like driving. Give me the car key. You're worried about, don't worry, I know you care, huh? I'm not running into any ladies today. Just give me the car key, I promise. Let me see you soon. Good day, sir. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. Uh, Bucci, let me go pack properly. All right, no problem. Uh, you're the photographer, right? Yes, sir. Uh, okay, it's nice you came earlier. You know what, just make yourself comfortable. Just hang around, okay? okay? We'll start the show shortly. Okay, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Hi. You're the driver, right? 
Uh, yes, uh, how can I help you? Uh, please, you know when the program will start? Uh, maybe in the next 45 minutes. Please, can I ask you a favor? Go ahead. Please, I left the house this morning without taking breakfast and I'm so hungry right now. Please, uh, uh, the program starts in 45 minutes. Can you drive me somewhere where I can eat breakfast and then we'll come back before it starts? Please, I beg you. Mm. I know this is not your car. Exactly. Okay, <laughs> it's your gas car, but don't worry, I'll find you something. Thank you. Get in the car. Okay, thank you. Okay, parked here. What is going on here? We, we, we parked right here. I parked the car here now. What about car? Yes. yes. Uh -huh. And I know police don't to come out now. Police? Ah. Told the car? Why? What did they tell you? What was the reason? Uh, what am I going to do? I'm for so sorry. Sake? Your girl will be very angry with you. I'm so what, sorry. What, it's what all my not... fault. Oh, what am I gonna do now? Oh. I, I really need to get to the lunch. I don't want to lose the job, please. Okay, you know what? You, you can go. I'll sort it. But my boss, don't worry. I, 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 I'll talk to him. I'm so sorry. It's this okay, is all my okay. fault. I'm terribly it's sorry, okay, please. It's okay, you can. But I hope you don't get sacked. Don't worry, don't worry. I am worry. terribly worry. sorry, please. I'll be fine. I'll sort it. I'm sorry. I have to go. I'm it's sorry. Okay. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, sir. I just stepped out to, to, to buy breakfast. What sort of an unprofessional behavior is this? I, I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. I, I asked you to hang around and you decided to go by your business? I apologize, sir. Please forgive me. I'm so sorry. No, just save your apology for yourself. I looked for you. I was even searching for you. I even tried to contact you and your number was switched off. I'm so sorry, sir. I sincerely apologize. Please, can we go? Um, You know what? I have contacted another photographer and he's inside. So just make sure you get back my deposit. No, sir. Please, I beg you. I beg you. You see that 100,000 naira that you paid me, eh? I will take it. Forget about the balance. There Let me just do no the job. no job to do. Ah, and like okay. I said, I've contacted another photographer and he's inside. So just make sure you get back my deposit. Right. Uh, David. David, where are you? I've been, I've been look hey, ma madam! Uh, David, where are you? I've been looking for you! At the event? Yes. Everything in my life just seems to be going wrong. Ah, babe, you're scaring me. What happened? Hmm. I got to the event well prepared. so embarrassing because how do I refund money that I already paid to the landlord? <laughs> hmm. uh, so, <laughs> what are you going to do? I don't know. The company already has your details and they might pull legal actions against you. Well, if they decide to take any legal action, I'm just going to tell them the truth that I do not have any money. And the only way I can pay back that money is to render free service to them whenever they have an event. <laughs> do you think they would agree? I don't know. And you needed to see the boss. The man looked so mean and stern. You needed to see the way that he was behaving. He almost chased me down the street. <laughs> Stop laughing. Stop laughing. If you see the way I was running, eh? I was running like a thief. 
Hmm. I was like a thief. I'm serious. <laughs> I can imagine how oh, you were running. Hmm. Ah. With your two left legs. <laughs> I'm telling you, I was, I was like a thief. Hmm. <laughs> you know who I feel for? Yeah. The driver, actually. Me too. Because his boss would definitely take it out on him. He might even lose his job. I know. I feel the same. I feel so terrible for him. And he's such a great guy. <sighs> as much as I feel bad for him, I'm just happy that I have my baby girl back with her head still on her neck. I hope so. I hope you don't come here looking for me. <laughs> oh, I will not be around when they're looking for you. <laughs> What a big deal that you just run again. You're good at running. <laughs> Aren't you? You saw the way that I ran. <laughs> Even I was surprised. Wait, come and show me the way you ran. Come and show me. <laughs> Stand <laughs> up. Was it like this? <laughs> just your voice. You need the outside. Good evening, Ma. Good evening, son. I'll call you back. Uh, good evening, Ma. Well, Gucci, welcome. Must have been a really busy day. Well, you can see that again. So, how did it go? Is someone going to say something? Um, the, 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 the truth is I, I didn't make it to the venue. But it wasn't intentional. I, my car got impounded by the police because I parked in the wrong space. Moment. I don't understand how the car was impounded in front of a restaurant. I mean, we both got to the office together. He had only one job, just to park the car at the office parking lot. How the car ended up being impounded in front of a restaurant still baffles me. What was your car doing packed in front of a restaurant? Because I know you don't eat out. I was just taking a piece. <laughs> taking a piece? David, you mean taking a piece? You spent five good hours in just taking a piece. But we had a successful launch, didn't we? Oh, <laughs> um, yes. Yes, we did. Apart from the fact that the first photographer we hired, she was a disaster. Mm -hmm. Yes, so I asked her to refund our deposit or else I will sue her. Um, like I said, <laughs> it was a great launch. <laughs> and um, the investors were impressed. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad they were taking a piss for five hours. I think you should go. I mean, it's later, really, oh. Mom. He needs to go. I'll be on my way, Ma. All right. Gucci? <laughs> I want to ask you a question. Uh, okay. Go ahead. The photographer, that... Uh, the lady. <laughs> to be honest, I have never seen a more unprofessional photographer like that girl in my life. Do you know she left the event and came back hours later really? apologizing? Wow. Anyway, that's by the way. I promise I'll make her refund the money. Oh, no, no. Don't make her refund the deposit. Don't worry about that. I'll, I'll take this case up personally myself. Um, David, I don't think that's a good idea. It is my job to handle issues like this and not yours. I understand, but you have a lot going on for you. You have product sampling, you have market survey. Just deal with those things. I will take this case up myself. I insist. If you say so. Great. Can I get her details? Um, oh, her number is in the car. Okay. Yes, I will forward her account details to you. I'm sure we can track her with that. That's all right. That's all right. All right Thank man. you so much. All right. Great See stuff. You. Yeah. Hmm. Push. Yeah, give me your side. No, side. So I'm just like this. Yeah, like that. Whoosh. Ooh. Girl, you're my muse. <laughs> okay, so turn up, turn. Just, yeah, yes, yes. Okay. Let me see your face. That way. Yes, yes. Um, raise your chin up a bit. Right, that's fire! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, your mama's wait. Just move this way a little. Right, 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 right. Mmm, I love it. Oh, <laughs> I 
love it. Hold on. Hello? Who is this? This is David. David? Who is David? Um, the driver. <sighs> the driver? You quickly drop the call. These people are smart. They're trying to use the driver to get through to you. It's a good thing you ended the call. Oh, oh yeah, pictures. Are you sure? Babe, don't worry. Hmm? Can I please come in? Are you serious? He was here today. Yeah. Apparently, he took the fall for me. And then he invited me on a date. Really? Are you going? Nope. Why? Isn't it obvious? We go on a date, we get talking, he gets into my head, and then Everything that happened before will happen again. Look, I'm not interested in another heartbreak. Mm. Well, I can't say I don't understand where you're coming from. So, tell me, what did you guys do? We just talked, really. David, are you okay? You haven't left your room since you returned. I'm okay, Ma. Are you sure? You know you can tell me anything that's bothering you, right? Today I... I asked a lady out on a date and uh, she stood me up. She even blocked my number. And I'm wondering what I have done to, you know, deserve all of that. My son. A woman can become protective of herself when she has been hurt deeply. You can't just pull her out of it at once. You have to be patient. Look, loving a woman is hard, okay? But loving a broken woman is so much harder. Be patient with her, okay? Okay, Ma. Try and win her trust and show her that you understand her. All right? Okay, Ma. So, promise me that you're going to have a good night rest? I promise I would have a good night rest. So, good night. Good night. All right. I love you, Ma. Love you too. Benita, we have run a spirometry and pulmonary function test, as well as exterior blood gas test and electrocardiogram ECG. The result shows that you have emphysema, a type of chronic obstruction pulmonary disease (COPD). You have a rare type called alpha-1 antityrosine deficiency, or alpha-1 for short, which simply means your condition is hereditary. Benita. You need a surgical procedure. You have delayed and your condition is getting worse.
David, what do you want? I, I just wanted to know why you stood me up yesterday. I do not want to make friends. Really? Yes. Wait, is it because I'm a driver? Oh, please stop with the pretense. I checked you out. Mm. I looked you up and I found out that you're the owner of the company. And that is the only reason why they are not holding me to pay the 100,000 air. Yes, you own the company, I know. So how long have you known this for? For a while now. Look, David, whether you're a millionaire or a driver, I really don't care. But what I said still stands. I do not want to go on a date with you. <coughs> Are you okay? <coughs> you're coughing blood. Sorry, sorry. It's nothing, don't worry about it. Please do not tell Lucy anything about this. That's okay. But, Benita, your condition is serious. And the doctor said you need an urgent surgery. Let me help you. I do not need anything from you. Thank you for taking me to the hospital. But most importantly, this doesn't change anything between us. Thank you. Take care of yourself. Thanks for coming, bro. This dinner means a lot to my mother. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you know I can't miss my favorite auntie's birthday dinner for anything in the world. I see. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it's London. How are you adjusting to the environment? Baba, that code won't kill us for that place. <laughs> but so far, it's been good. I see. Yeah, I can't really stay in Nigeria for too long. You know, I just left Lagos, yeah. so I don't want me people to see me around mm -hmm. before it will cause problem with my Yubo wife. That's guy. Nice. <laughs> well, how about, uh, how about you? Are, you? are you seeing someone? I'm not seeing someone. Not really, but it's someone I really like, you know? Mm. I've been trying to get her on a date, but. She's being defensive. Yeah. I swear to God, man. <laughs> Bro, mm. you know women now, when they start to do gra, gra like that, it means you're on the right path. Mm. Yeah, man, just apply pressure. Pressure? I tell you. Wisdom, wisdom. <laughs> you, know, <laughs> you know what? Why don't you invite her to dinner? I'll help you out. Tina, are you sure she'd like to come? If you like this girl, you have to make it happen, man. Okay, I will make it up. <laughs> Bye, nigga. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> so good to be back in Lagos. You're welcome, bro. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Mom? I had started to think that you finally understood that I am not interested in anything. And all of a sudden, boom, you reappear again. David, what do you want? If you came here to ask me out again, I want you to know that my answer still stands. I am not going on a date with you. I'm offering you a job. It's my mom's 60th birthday and I want you to come take her pictures. I'll pay you. Okay. Okay. Um... Do you guys uh, need a makeup artist? My friend is a really good makeup artist. Like, she's great. She's one of the best in her industry. I can maybe come along with her? That's okay. So you're taking the offer, right? Yes, I am. <laughs> good. So can you please unblock my number so I can give you further details? I will. But strictly business. The strictly business. Strictly business. Strictly business. Okay. Unblocked. Bro, 
Yo. She's here. Yeah? Yeah. You ready? But, but I, I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> good, good. All right, take Cool your mind down. <laughs> now let's go get your coin. This is beautiful, right? So beautiful. I know. You're good at this job. <laughs> Thank you. So I'll take it from this one. <clears throat> Oh, David, I'm sorry. I'm trying to get another angle for... Let's go. Let's go. Scum. What's happening? Look, I don't need to explain anything to you. She's my ex, and she got mad that I relocated. That's a big lie. Tell me what you did to her. Tell me! Stop this nonsense, both of you. Stop it at once! You can't fight over a woman like Miss Kretz. No. She's not just any woman. I love her so much, and I'm about to lose her because of what he you, did to you her. You can't love her. Tell me why I cannot love her. Tell me why I cannot love her. Because she's sick. She's very sick. I left her because she's sick. You left her because of her condition? She must be a terrible person. David, where are you going to? David, come back! You know what, Mom? I don't care if she's sick or not. I'll look for her and ensure that everything wrong with her is fine, okay? David! David, wait! Come back! What is going on, Frank? A condition requires an immediate long volume reduction surgery, LVRS, and um, How much is the procedure, sir? Um, seven million. What? Please go ahead. Sir, you need to understand that Benita's case has really deteriorated. And if I'm to be honest with you both, the survivor chance for the surgical procedure is a 50-50 chance. Doctor, you know what? Please do everything you can do to bring her back to life. Doctor, please help us. Benita is my only friend. I can't lose her. Please. Um. Okay. You both need to sign some papers before we can proceed. That's okay. We need to sign it. I'm so scared. Don't I don't want anything to happen to me.
I'm sorry, Brent, I didn't tell you. But I think she knows if you were aware of how much she was suffering, it would really break your heart. She's my strong woman. And uh, I'm sorry about Frank. David, we honestly don't know how to thank you. You're such a good man. Thank you so much for everything. It's okay. Maybe you should just go home and um, get her some items. I'll be here and I'll, I'll watch over her. Are you sure? Yeah. Days. I think you should go home and freshen up. Yeah, I'm okay. I insist. I don't want to leave her side. Do you want your smell to choke her in her sleep? Oh, but I'm not smelling. I know, please. Just go home and freshen up at least. Okay? Take care of her, just go home. See what she did right there? Mm. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you very much for everything, David. Lucy told me all that you did. It's okay. What do you want from me, David? The truth is I don't even know. I'm sure you don't remember the first time I saw you, but I do. At the event? Before the event. Really? So some time ago, I ran into you and Lucy. I think guys were coming from the club. And to be honest, I thought you were a couple. Really? Like together? Mm -hmm. No. I don't roll that way. But wait. That night, I remember the details of that night vaguely. We had so much to drink. That was you? 
Exactly, myself and uh, a good friend. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Even though it happened at night, I, I, I just couldn't take your face off my head. And I prayed every single day that I get to set my eyes on you again. And God, God answered it on the event launch. And I thought you were a driver. Every perfect love story started with the wrong assumption. Beauty assumed the beast was a monster. The prince assumed Cinderella was a princess. I assumed you and your friend were an item. And you assumed I was a driver. <laughs> Look, David, you're a very kind person, but I don't want to be with anybody at this time. I need time for myself. I need time to heal. Love has dealt me a very terrible blow using your cousin, Frank. I'm sorry, but I'm not ready for a relationship at this time. Don't worry. Take your time. I'm not going anywhere. I'm here to stay. I'm not my cousin. I'm not Frank. Okay, she's free to go now, okay? But oh, please, she needs as much rest as she can get until she's strong to move again, okay? Thank you, doctor. Thank you so much, doctor. I appreciate you so much. I'm so happy. Come on. Come on. Very baby. Oh, baby. Okay, very nice to see you. Great, great. I think we should take another one. Do your legs. Let's see. Calm down. Oh, it's the expertise, yo. Let me use a bit of a Teach us, teach us what to do. Crazy faces. Love isn't the only perfect picture there is. Friends are also perfect pictures. This is my perfect picture. A friend who would never leave you and a man. Well, let's see where this goes. I never said you could only have one perfect picture. <laughs>